Welcome back to Work at a Super Yacht, where today we're going out on a sea trial and I'm going to be walking you through the complete departure and arrival manoeuvres out and then back into our stern to berth. We're going to be looking at it from the perspective of the aft deck and you join us here as we're bringing in the passerelle and getting ready to slip the lines. So here we are, back out on the water. It's good to be back, like uh, like the good old times. We're just gonna run up and down a few times, do a few checks. Um, it's been sat in the port, so it's always good to, to come out for a sea trial periodically, even through the during the winter months, just to turn everything over and, and make sure that everything is in good order. So we're just gonna take care of that, and while we're at it, take the opportunity to test the emergency steering so that's just a case of flicking over the valves and then we can check that the emergency steering is working and I think I'll probably do a, a separate video about that anyway because um, that's something that anyone who goes to work on a yacht especially as a deckhand is definitely going to end up on the emergency steering as part of a drill um, and yeah you often find that the the way to switch over to the emergency steering is in some sort of quirky fashion um, or you have to get into a tiny little hole to steer the boat. Um, I'm sure any of you who've experienced it can attest to that fact. At the same time as that, the deckhand and I are just doing periodical rounds of the boat just to check that all is in order. We've obviously got all the 
the furniture stowed and everything strapped down but just in case it's good to walk around the boat um, make sure that uh, nothing's flying away or that something hasn't fallen and has now become a, a safety hazard or um, is causing some sort of damage to the boat. Back up forward here, just had to remind the deckhand to make sure that these teeth are engaged. That way if either of the brakes fails, this cannot run free. Okay then, so that's the end of the sea trial and uh, now we're heading back into port so I'll stick the camera on and let you see what we're up to. Natural distance to ground line stop sign, 10, 10 one, one zero, zero. Thank you. 
The engines have now been switched off, which means we can go down to the swim platform to rig the spring lines, then work with the team on the foredeck to make sure that the yacht is in the right position. And that's the end of the sea trial. Um, the first time I've tried to film something like that, so I don't know what we got, but hopefully we'll be able to put something good together. Now it's just a case of uh, rinsing down the boat, we're all tidied up, um, but yeah, a little bit salty. 17, what was it? 17, 18 knots? Yeah, yeah. we'll do that. So um, yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.